Hey everyone, how you doing? Merry Christmas. I hope everyone's doing all right. You know, the fun part, you know, is, is pretty much done. You know, you go in there, you get your gifts, you get all this shit, you put it in your car, and you, you know, make sure you lock it. And then, you know, Santa got all the kids, all the shit, and now you're, you, now the real thing comes. You got to actually sit down with these people and eat with them. You have to have dinner with these people. And it's like, oh, God, this is going to be fun. You have already put on your war paint. You're getting ready to wreck that woke retard, <laughs> blue-haired, feminist, loser cousin of yours. Yeah, you're going in there. It, you, you got your war face. And uh, hell, man, Christmas is hell. And if you work retail, you're already just, you have zero appetite for anybody. You just see motherfuckers every day. There's just a non-ending fucking line and just non-ending, like, set of problems and customers and these fucking people. And now it's your family. So you're about to take all of that out on them. And rightfully so, because fuck these people. You hate them, they hate you. You know? It's like, oh yeah, dad. Let me tell you about my dad. My fucking dad growing up. Guy be like, I'd be like, yeah, dad, my allowance is gone. Someone stole my allowance. You know what my dad told me? Yeah, sometimes in life, your allowance just gets stolen. He's like, he stole my fucking allowance. This asshole. Give me money, just take it away. Go get some beer, dad. Thanks, thanks, dad. <laughs> like, you do this shit all the time. Yeah, pre yeah, dad. Remember, uh, yeah, well, sometimes in life, like, uh, motherfucker leaves me at the YMCA and the police get called because, you know, everyone has to go home and dad doesn't show up. You know what? Please bring me home. And the door is like wide open. Fucking dad is in my room, clearly jerking off to porn, passed out drunk, dick hanging out. And the police are like, sir. Yeah, that's my dad. And then last year I went home for fucking Christmas. And uh, yeah, let me tell you, this is what happened. Like I went to my old room because dad is being a fucking drunk dick again. <laughs> and like I'm sitting there he's like hey, come out here and the whole family is like just like watching on a bunch of assholes they are and uh yeah this is what the door looked like <laughs> like I was just sitting there listening to him on the other side of the door and I was thinking of the door and I was like man fuck him fucking took a, a, a sip of, a shot of whiskey and I was like I just imagined my dad's face in the door and I just punched his face. And I actually punched through the door and hit him in his face. And then he just started punching through the door. So we're punching through the fucking door. And yeah, that's what you get. So fun times, Christmas. So put your wharf paint on. You don't know what you're going to get this year. Your uncle might pull out a gun on uh, somebody. And you, you might have to back him up. You know, who knows? But if you're feeling, you know, down or like, you need a drink, then, you know, fuck it, drink up now, make everything more interesting, and, uh, you know, just remember, you, you want to get back to your friends, but before you just, like, blow up on your entire family, you know, what you really just need to remember, all you're trying to do is get your shit and get the fuck out of there, remember earlier I said, make sure you lock your car, because you got a bunch of klepto fucking a bunch of klepto motherfuckers that they're, they're just gonna rob you that loser cousin of yours i was talking about earlier blue-haired fucking retard feminist yeah you know look keep an eye on her and just like kind of just sit by the where you could see your car and you should be good like then you can go home and have a merry christmas and um <laughs> like Leahy here yeah you'll be good you get your shit, you get out of there. Hell, if you get a shot, um, you know, that klepto, she's going to steal some shit. Just steal some of the shit that she stole, and no one will know any of the wiser. They'll just assume that she stole it. So that's how you deal, or how I tend to deal with, like, family on Christmas. And then I go home, back to my boys, and, you know, 
watch an episode of the Trailer Park Boys and, uh, you know, have a couple drinks, be the liquor, and that's your life. That's all it is, man. I'm just saying, at the end of the day, you just sit there, you grin and bear it, and then you just go home and take all the people, these people, they gave you a bunch of shit and uh, steal from the bitch that stole a bunch of shit from everybody, and you're good to go. Like, you're golden. And that's what Christmas is all about. Anyway, I hope everyone has a Merry Christmas, seriously. And I'll see you in the next video. And it won't be Christmas anymore. And you know what? That's a good thing. Because if you work in retail, Christmas, fuck Christmas. I'll tell you, Christmas is real fun. Christmas, yeah. It's, it's, uh, it is what it is, man. This is Christmas. It just makes you feel like this in retail. It's just like, yeah, you, this is what you want to do. Yeah. And there you go. I hope everyone has a wonderful Christmas. I really do. And I'll see you in the next video. And to anyone out there that uh, isn't, you know, feeling the Christmas spirit, you know, just fucking whatever. No, dude, you're fucked. Your family sucks. You fucking just get your shit and get out of there. And uh, that's the best you could do. <laughs> that being said, Merry Christmas. Thank you.